Let's innovate. Let's innovate. Let's innovate. Let's innovate. The business that we find ourselves, we have to be innovative. Absolutely innovative, because if you are not, then you'll not survive uh, in this market. But also it's because our customers see us as innovative and they continue expect to expect innovative products uh, from ourselves and products that are uh, products and solutions that actually bring convenience to their lives. So in mounting the, um, the Upwiz challenge, um, our expectation is that uh, our, our developers have the opportunity to actually make a contribution in our transforming lives agenda. We are committed to supporting startups. We are committed to ensuring that uh, businesses will come out of this. Young people will start businesses that not only support the economy, but also transform their own lives. What stands out for me on the positive is that these are young people. Most of them have just come out of high school, barely even started campus, and they are, they are having such great ideas and such great energy. I am actually very uh, impressed about that. I've seen a steady and gradual growth that actually has been more positive. Before, there was a lot of... Um, things that were very bad on the eye, very poorly thought out ideas, and there were just uh, people are creating stuff for purposes of creating. But now we've seen people thinking more holistically about um, solution provision, thinking more about the design, thinking more about the business model. So we've gone a long way. Um, globally, we might not be there yet, because you know, once you open it up to a global playing field, you're talking about some um, serious commitment and some serious talent, but you're getting there. What I would recommend is mentorship, to get the startups to be able to focus on a specific area, exposure to research, data, so that they're able to know where the real gaps and opportunities are for them. And then they can be able to develop solutions to meet these gaps. Let's innovate. Let's innovate. Let's innovate. Let's innovate. Let's innovate. We are developing an app uh, called uh, a team locator. To, to be able to assist people to locate uh, the ATM points. The app idea and the basic development for the application started in January 2014. This is August, the application is ready. Uh, so far we have it published on the iPads and we are working on the online platform as well as Android at the moment. Metro Motors is, is a solution that uh, encompasses convenience in terms of mapping. Where do you get uh, the nearest uh, terminals for where you want to go? or the, route, the best alternative route to take, and also it encompasses uh, mobile payment. Our application is called Budget Siku. It's an Android mobile application that helps in budgeting. Lots of improvement from, from last year uh, in terms of even market, market intelligence. We've seen students applying themselves more in terms of looking, theming their products with what is sellable not just you know, what I would want to put out there. I've been impressed by the quality of ideas that have come through this particular uh, session of the AppWiz Challenge. Um, the focus, I think, on this particular round has been more on the technology. Uh, I think more work needs to be done in terms of the market uh, research by the team that are participating in this uh, AppWiz uh, Challenge. Um, that to make sure that this application is actually relevant in the marketplace. Our application is called SEMA application. It's an app that translates from international languages to local Kenyan languages. The experience at SEMA was so awesome. We had mentors coming over to show us and guide us on how to do our product. And also we had sessions whereby we had people coming and telling us how to develop our business ideas and taking us through the whole process. Upwiz 2014 has been a good experience for the team magazine Real because we came here as a novelty idea and we are coming out with a, project, uh, with a product that is already is ready for, for, for market. As magazine Real, we've learned to be resilient during our Upwiz stay and uh, we, we know that after Upwiz we are still going to be operational. These uh, startups look very promising 
made up of very youthful Kenyans and we believe uh, many of them actually are in line with uh, most of our uh, strategic pillars and I believe we can work with them to develop very good partnerships uh, and forge very good uh, future with them.